Hey guys, and a happy Saturday. On today's video, we're going to talk about why do other naturals freak out of, over other naturals putting a perm in their hair? Well, I don't understand why, but then again, I do understand why. I'll tell you why I think people freak out when other naturals put relaxers in their hair. Some kind of way we have an emotional attachment to other people's hair. My friend here, well, she's somewhere back there. She has this thing about wanting to put a relax in her hair, but she doesn't really want to relax in her hair. She just doesn't know how to take care of it. So when she gets frustrated, she'll put a relax in her hair, and then it breaks off, and then she'll cut the relaxer back off, and then put the relaxer back in, and then cut the relaxer back off and stuff like that. So I get pretty frustrated with her when she does that. But why? Why do I get emotionally frustrated about her hair? It's her hair, right? Well, I think because, especially if you are a person who does um, vlogs online, your followers, your viewers, they watch you through your ups and downs and your trials and tribulations. And once you finally get your hair in the condition that you really want it in and what they think looks nice, you turn around and change your mind in the middle of the journey and say, I don't want to do this no more. I ain't one of those people, I will say in a minute, I don't want to do it no more and I will quit. And, uh, but yeah, we get attached to people if we are following them, just like television shows. I don't know if some of you guys remember this, but if you are, if you are one of my older subscribers, you will, you all will remember JR from, um, well, it's not NASA Land. What's the name of that show? I can't think of it. I'll put it on the screen. But remember JR back in the day? JR was a mean mother sucker, and he caused conflict and problems with everybody. He was a very mean, hateful character. But do you know people hated him in real life? They hated him in real life. And when he died, they was happy he died. Why was they happy he died? Because he was mean in the, in the show. He was not mean in real life. And he used to always say, I am not JR in real life. That's just my character. But you have, and you have, JR has done a, such a great job with being that character to where it, people really thought that he was actually that character. So... The same thing with natural hair. We get, sometimes we can get a, we, I don't know what to call it, but it's not really attached, but emotionally involved. So say for instance, I'm on here and I'll, you guys have been following me for a while. I've been going through ups and downs with my hair. My hair was red when I started. It was broke off, blah, blah, blah. And if I turn around in, in the middle of my journey, cause you know I'm growing my hair down to my waist. I was gonna grow it to my tailbone, but I think I changed my mind about that, but we'll see. Uh, if, I, if I come on here and say, hey, I don't want. I want. I don't want no more uh, natural hair. And I put a perm in my hair. You guys will have a fit because you all you all have been following me, and you all want to see me succeed in my journey. You don't want me to quit and fail. If I was to do something to my hair like that, you all would be like, "No, that's not what the agreement was. Why would you put that in your hair? Perms are bad. Blah 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 blah. That's why you put the perm. That's why you cut the perm out. Why would you go back to that? And I'm gonna be honest with you guys. When I see women put perms in their hair, there's a big chance. They always have regrets and cut the perm right back out their hair and say, you know what? I'm not doing it no more. But it's just hair. We can have fun with it. We can get tired. We could, you know, want to try something else for a while. But you best believe, you, you know, I had the meltdown, right, about my hair, um, the kinkiness. No matter how much I get frustrated with my kinks, I will never put a perm back in my hair. I don't like perms. I personally don't like them. Um, I don't like them because they change my hair brown. Uh, I don't like the smell of it. I don't like my hair. I don't like my scalp burning. I don't do well with taking care of it. It always breaks off. It looks ugly. I don't like it. But I will say, if I get to the point where I don't want to be bothered with it anymore, I will cut it back down. And I liked my hair when it was short. When it was this little, I used to rock that baby fro. Oh my God. I can get in the shower, shampoo it, come back out and put some little juices and berries in it. And honey, I can be on my way. Like right now, um, it takes more time to do my hair. And I've been trying to get myself mentally prepared to start, you know, doing my hair. Because uh, it's so much work. I have a lot of hair. Okay? So anyway, guys, that's it. That's why I think people get upset when others... I think that's one reason why people get upset. Why other uh, people, other naturals put perms in their hair. Now, you tell me your reason why you think you or somebody else may get upset because they, you know, somebody else put a perm in their hair. Uh, I try not to get too emotionally attached to other people's hair 
But like I said, with my friend, when she when she goes back and forth with her hair, yeah, I get pretty frustrated because I want to see her have healthy hair. I want her to have that hair she she so desires. She wants long, healthy, natural hair, but she just doesn't know how to take care of it. And she goes around in this cycle, in this circle, over and over and over again. So if you're a person who thinks about who's thinking about getting a perm in your hair, um, make sure you know how to take care of it. Because I've seen some, like my one buddy, she has some beautiful permed hair. She does a very good job taking care of it. You can have healthy, long hair with a perm. Just because your hair is natural does not mean it's not, not damaged. doesn't mean it's healthy. It just means it's just in its natural state. Really, we don't have natural hair. It's just our hair that grows out of our head. And we say natural because we're so used to putting other stuff in our hair like perms. But it's really not natural. It's just our hair. So once you learn how to take care of your hair, you don't, you know, you don't be tripping off no perms and stuff. But I don't know. It's a cycle. We all have them. Okay, guys, I wanted you to see this green glow I got on my face. Do you see this green glow on my face? I'm rocking a green glow, and I'm rocking some colorful eyelashes today. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, if you are interested in this lipstick, this lipstick is, where is it? This is by ColourPop. It is called Dr. M. Ain't that pretty? I'll put it in the description box. And I have this uh, MAC gloss on top of it because it is, this lipstick's dry down, matte and dry. And this is called, what color is this? Lime Green Spring Bean <laughs> A92. I'll put that on top. So yeah, guys, that is it. Um, that's it for today. Thank you guys for loving on my Shay Shay yesterday in the video. Uh, she is something else. And I know I, I called her, her tug of war toy uh, a dildo. Please disregard that. Uh, that didn't mean to come out in um, in my video because me and my friends, we call it a double-ended dildo. We say it so fluently and so regular to where we forgot. I forgot to not, you know, I just forgot to not say that. But then again, I said it in my other video when she was in it. So anyway, you girls and guys know how I talk. I will say deal though in my video though. Yeah. All right. So me and my friend, we're going to go out and have some fun. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye. <sighs> Why? Why would you put a perm in your hair? You got to say her when you come to St. Louis. Why would you put a perm in your hair? My friend... <laughs> She had put her uh, her wig on my chair. She said, I put my hair on my chair. <laughs> yeah, we talk like that in St. Louis. Peace. <laughs> Girl, I am rocking this green lip on their ass.